In this video, we're returning to the 1948 Bauman set. This is the number nine Andy Phillip rookie card. Centering's a little off. There's a stain on that one side, but we got the card. That's the important thing. The 1948 Bauman set is, uh, of course, the first major basketball set ever. This number nine Andy Phillip card is in the first series, so it's a bit more accessible and not as rare as the second series cards. But this is a true rookie card, marking Andy Phillips' first year in the BAA. You can see if we turn the card over. Year in BAA first. So it is a reminder that the 1948 Bauman cards are Basketball Association of America cards. Andy Phillip is also a member of the Hall of Fame, so this adds a touch of value to the card as well. Going back to the reverse of the card, in our last 1948 Bauman video, I mentioned these giveaways. I'm going to mention it again. So, 10 basketball wrappers, and you would get this uniform here. I really, really would love to see if, I just I talk about a super collector, if anyone still has the uniform from the 1948 Bauman set. I mean, what an item <laughs> that that would be. Um, you know, I hope you indulge me in taking those tangents, but I, I really think it's fascinating if, if, if someone did the redemption and that item lasted till today. Um, okay, moving on. Important information about this card. This may be the second uncorrected error on a basketball card, apart from minor typos, that is. We talked about the first uncorrected error. That was the 1933 Gaudi Sport Kings Joe Lopchik card that misspelled Joe Lapchick's name. Now, on this Andy Phillip card, I want you to look at the hometown on the back. The card says Granite City, Indiana. The state's wrong. Andy Phillip was born in Granite City, but in Illinois. In fact, you can see his whole life revolved here around Illinois. After being born there, Here's his college, the University of Illinois. And then, as you can tell from that uniform on the front of the card, he joined the Chicago Stags of the BAA. And it does mention this on the back. Really interesting fact. He also played professional baseball. He started his career with Decatur. So there's another Illinois connection. Really important athlete in Illinois sports history. Now, Andy Phillip was still playing, and he is present in the 1957 Topps basketball set nine years later. So, if you were thinking that this one card completes your Andy Phillip collection, think again. Um, this card's often overlooked, but I just think this is a must-have from the 1948 Bauman. It's a Hall of Fame rookie card, it was a, a baseball-basketball dual player. And you have that little mention, uncorrected error of the wrong state for his place of birth. All of that combined, I, I, I think this is a neat one. Well, we'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.